Hello everyone on YouTube, this is Susie and I am making this video to show you guys my latest cake. This is a crown on a pillow cake and this is for my mother-in-law's birthday party. I made the same cake last week but in a different pillow and um, in the color pink for a little girl's fourth birthday party and for some reason the video did not work. So I'm making um, a video of this one and hopefully you guys will like it. I'll try to put up some pictures of the other one which was also very beautiful um, up on YouTube in still pictures along with this one. Um, anyway, uh, like I said, this is a carved pillow cake. Um, the crown inside the red is cake. Then every other detail is made out of gum paste. I sprayed uh, the crown with disco dust, some in pink, some in red. So you can't really see the effect, but um, it's there. It's very shiny, um, very pretty. Um, anyway, a little bit about this cake. I made this cake last week, um, as I mentioned, and it took me 14 hours. Believe it or not, you guys are probably going to think I'm full of BS. It took me two hours to do this one. <laughs> Um, last week it was a lot of trial and error. I broke a whole bunch of stuff. I couldn't figure out how to get these things um, up and going, and it was a hot mess. But the cake out came out came out pretty beautiful and awesome. But 14 hours, I didn't think it was worth it. This one, I knew where I was going. I knew what I was doing already. Got everything ready beforehand. All my pieces dried, and voila, two hours. I mean this really just turned out to be one of the easiest cakes I've done even though it looks like it's very detailed it is but since I knew what I was doing already it kind of all just flowed um anyway I just um dried some gum paste pieces on a heart mold six, six inch heart mold um overnight and I made the beads with a push mold as well the floor, the leaf was with a mold, and I just kind of added all these little decorative details by basically cutting and pasting um, each piece onto each other. Uh, this is kind of like just ruffled fondant um, added to a six inch cake and a ball and half a ball, um, one on top of the other to create this shape. Um, and pretty much if I sit here and explain everything, it'll be 14 hours. But anyway, you guys get the clue. Uh, basically, that's it to the cake. There's not much. I made this scroll, um, and it says, Para la reina del día, feliz cumpleaños, Cecilia. And basically, that translates to the queen of the day, happy birthday. Um, her name is Cecilia, my mother-in-law. Um, so we just kind of wanted to make it like, you know, She's royalty today, so this cake was definitely fit for the occasion. Um, aside from that, uh, that's all there is to the cake. It's pearlized with an airbrush, and I did add some shadowing with gold, but you can't really see it on here, but, you know, you guys get the picture. Anyways, I hope you guys like the cake. I'd love to hear from you, hear your comments. Let me know. Thank you to everyone that keeps subscribing and everyone that watches my videos. I really appreciate it, and I hope to hear from you guys. Thank you so much. Bye.